Scientology contains tools and methods to assist you in finding your own answers to life's questions, your own truths about your life and you. But who are you? You are not a physical body. And if you have your appendix removed, your personality does not change. You are not any less who you are. When you talk about the parts of your body, you probably say, this is my arm, this is my leg, these are my hands. You instinctively know that your body is something that you have, not what you are. Your body is something you use. So if you're not your body, what are you? Your mind? To answer that, you need to understand what the mind is. Your mind is something you use to figure things out. It is far more accurate than any computer. It has a memory bank containing pictures. All the memories of everything that's ever happened to you. When you think of something, you get a picture of it. But if you can see these pictures, even when your eyes are closed, then what is it that's looking at the pictures? It's you. You are a being, an intelligence, a consciousness, that part of you that is aware of being aware. In Scientology, we use the word Thetan. The term Thetan is taken from the Greek letter theta, which has long served as a symbol for thought or spirit. We use Thetan to avoid confusions with other concepts and beliefs regarding the soul or spirit. It isn't something you have. You wouldn't say, my Thetan. You'd simply say, me. You have a body. You have a mind. You are a Thetan. Scientology offers tools you can use to increase your abilities and reach your full potential in life. For the subject of Scientology is you.